Hello there ladies and gentlemen, Signal here, welcome back to another video. I'm sorry if I'm not gonna be at my best currently, because uh, I've been uh, with the boys to, to a barbecue yesterday, and I'm currently working on zero hours of sleep last night, and I'm gonna try my best to m make a video. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Got Enchantress here, and uh, Enchantress is gonna have this thing, and some people ask me in the comments, and I don't know if this removes the Robin King Hazard, but I guess we can just try it and find out. But yeah, whenever you're using Terror Special, she's supposed to do a bunch of things and most importantly, remove a hazard. Where what, where does it say exactly? Large Immortal Dome that uh, removes opponent hazards. Okay, let's see if the Robin King hazard gets removed, if it gets permanently removed or appears afterwards. And then we're gonna try and transition into a Puppet Beast Boy. We got Sight on Manta, let's, let's get this going. I think I tried this before, but I just forgot. Okay, get Manta in there. The Enchantress Terror Special is actually pretty expensive. Okay, now we have the problem that the hazard is not here yet. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, okay, the hazard is gone. Actually, wonder if it's gonna stay gone. Okay, Manta is not able to hit, so. hit him anymore. No, it disappears. It disappears. Yeah, it's pointless. It, it, it reappears like the. No, I'm, I'm trying, boys. I'm really trying today. Uh, but yeah, the, the hazard zone actually reappears after the enchantress thing is um, gone. And I honestly think this was exactly what was gonna happen, but say. Hey, not too bad to try it anyway. And be able to tell you guys for sure. But yeah, you're able to remove them, but they come back. You're gonna only be able to remove them for a short period of time. And honestly, you don't need to. And you just shouldn't do that. Let's let him super move here. Because that's gonna put me, uh, me in the middle of the field. And away from the hazard that's incoming currently. Because I need to kind of find ways right now with Beast Boy to avoid the hazard zone. Because we can definitely avoid it. And yeah, Batum and the Drown does a good number on this man. So you don't need to worry too much about the hazard with that. Because God Killer is going to reduce the... Oh, 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 oh. We don't have the... We definitely don't have uh, the, the health to push through it. I was like, yeah, we're just going to push him. And then the hazard is going to be left behind. Manta sitting on zero health currently, though we can still use him because Manta's got zero health, but he's still pushing the enemy because this man is blinded and can't kill me. So I used Manta in a way to walk through the hazard because he was hitting on zero HP anyway. I mean, yeah, Beast Boy is not the best thing you can do here, obviously. But it's just something that was like, yeah, I'm going to use this after the Enchantress, whatever happens. Because he doesn't need much and he didn't really need that third team member. Or was not something that was essential. Oh no, the hazard's coming back, boys. Uh, uh Maybe super move? Yeah, this is... I, I mean, I don't need the power for Beast Boy anyway. And that just put me in the middle of the field. And it's going to give me, again, some room to maneuver. Yeah, you can play around the hazard even if you don't use Batman on the ground, as you can see here. But yeah, generally speaking, you reduce his attack, you reduce the hazard damage. I mean, yeah, this didn't go badly, but it's not going to be a one-shot, because Beast Boy, or at least the Beast Boy on this account, needs a very, very convenient fight to get a one-shot, and this was nothing like a convenient fight. But yeah, let's move on. Okay, let's uh, finish this with uh, Batman and the Drowned, with God Killer. Got my boy John here, with the side equipped. And then we got Robin King with Puppet, so let's get this going. Hopefully it's gonna go well, I mean, there's not many ways it could go wrong, but bro, the state I'm in, after no sleep and the alcohol, we're not doing... This is not looking good, boys. But yeah, it's probably gonna be fine. Um, there's no way I messed up a Batman the Drowned fight on a 
Well, that's a good start. There's no way I, I messed up a pet to win the ground fight on a barely alive Robin King. Might as well super move his puppets eventually gonna go away, so you might as well benefit from that. Power that we had there. Okay, there we go, we got him. Now he's dealing no damage, he's gonna get eventually constant blind supply to him. Yeah, one more tag in from Batman the drum should actually do it. Okay, we're doing decent damage. And he's dead. Bro, then why did you have to... Why did you have to kill your other self before dying? Like, right before dying. Like, that was the last thing you did. Why you had to do that? But yeah, let's take a look at the rewards we got for this one. And we got... Wow, Sub-Zero, that's garbage. We're here, we're gonna go ahead and kill Starfire real quick. Uh, with Raven. With Dark Metal cards. Raiden with Twin Blade. And a level 8 Sight. So let's get, let's get this going. Oh boy, I actually need the Cowboy dropped. Oh no. Oh no. I can do this. Hopefully. In our special one. Keep pushing her a bit to the corner. Raven back in. Okay, now we can super move with Raven actually. Without risking to lose the darkness from uh, Raven. And I honestly don't know if we got the damage here. Or not to kill her. Probably we do, unless I mess up. Yeah, yeah, we definitely do. Unless I mess up terribly. But it's just to an extent muscle memory at this point. Like, my brain is not really properly processing exactly what's happening. But it's going well. It's kind of hard to explain. Okay, we almost got her. Come on. Rave him back in. Just a bit more, I just need to not mess up a bit a bit longer. Raven back in. Darkness applied again. And that might be the last tag, and that's what I needed from uh, Raven, generally speaking, which should be fine here. There we go. Let's move on to... Bro, what? What? Are you okay, my boy? You even scared me a bit with that flash, bright flash on the screen. It, it killed the, the, the last of my neurons that were still there, still alive at this point. Let's Let's move on. And for last fight, let's try and kill my boy Scarecrow here. I need to use Harley because she needs to remove the dot resistance. We got Dark Mellow cards on him. And I'm going to try to activate Puppet on EPI, I think. It'll not be the easiest thing to activate Puppets on her. But we should be fine, I think. Hopefully, maybe. Yeah, let's see what we can do about this one. This is another one that I got a combo drop. But it's Scarecrow. It's literally the character you learn how to combo and drop on. Should be fine. So we do need power generates, that's for sure. For EPA to stand any chance to activate infinite power. Oh, 
bad here. Oh, specials disabled is not great here. No, it's so hard to combo and drop after a special one for some reason. Okay, we got infinite power. Can we keep this? I think we can. I think we can. You just need two negative effects, and if you do a third special and it hits the negative effects from the puppet, it's gonna be guaranteed infinite power at that point. Oh, we should be fine. Doesn't matter who tanks it. I just want TPI in there because she needs to keep the puppet going. Because I mean, it was it wasn't that hard to activate it actually. To be fair, do we need to push this man all the way back to the corner? Also, this is my max plus extension left of Joker, so he's he's very built. Bro, what was that tag in attack? That was cringe. Maybe I should tag him in more often though, and focus less on uh, how many puppets stacked I got. Oh boy, I saw some decent values here. I don't know where that 30... Oh, I lost infinite power. Uh, are we fine at this point to just hit him and hope to eventually kill him? We might be fine. Yeah, I saw 38 mil value flying out of nowhere. That was that was a nice nice sight to behold. No, I think I'm not killing this. I, I kind of messed up and lost Papa there. My bad. Yes, I could have played this better. But hey, I'm trying my best here, considering the circumstances. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, definitely would have been killable. It was just not meant to be today. Oh, I don't want to leave him at low health. I mean, at not low enough health. Because he's great for distance. Like, he needs some muscle to get through this. And this is not a reasonable... Uh, might be a reasonable amount of damage to ask tomorrow from King with Puppet, with Zatanna. We'll see. But yeah, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye.